All right, welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Unity. Today we're going to be doing Sugar's Legacy, and uh, yeah, let's just get started. Alright, so it basically states the same exact thing. Oh, wait. Tower of the Sword. Okay, so yeah, like I was saying, uh, you need to do all the riddles to, to, to get that sword. Alright. So yeah, the first two riddles we're going to be getting are uh, basically for the main story. Uh, I have to go all the way up there? Yep, I think I do. Okay. <gasps> Alright, am I supposed to go all the way to the top? Okay, there we go. So it says guardian staring brooding horn amongst monsters on the house of God circled by our ring. I assume they're talking about a gargoyle. I just want to read the uh, riddle. I keep getting all these tips. <laughs> all right, there we go. My obscure gaze on the Lord's outpost, the stars reflect at its height outmost. At its height outmost. Oh, okay. It's a cross all the way over there. All right. I was honestly about to jump. I thought there was like a uh, freaking uh, haystack or something. All right. So, yeah, we're supposed to uh, reach the other side then. All right. Can't figure out a way to uh, to get down. Okay, there we go. Hey, I've got a message for you. So yeah, we actually have it easy this time around. That the game is helping us out with like highlighting a green circle to just give us a uh, you know area of like where it could actually be the next riddle because when you're supposed to do these alone you don't get any help at all <laughs> it is pretty hard 
Lady of the Gates within reach of her infernal weights are Bane of Devil's number. Did I just... All right, so the second one is actually uh, not that far away from us. Yeah, I'm not even going to mess with any of the enemies if I don't need to. You get a good amount of money for doing these. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Reflection of the... Yeah, I might have to disable the uh, hints, HUD, uh, because uh, it does get kind of annoying, I'm not going to lie. You see, that, that's actually kind of hard. Be it St. Andrews or the Almighty Sun, I'm the one to choose the shining form of suns. You know, if you just read that, you know, without having any clues, like that right there is going to be like a hard one to, uh, to do. Can I cross over this thing? I guess not. Okay. All right, so then we got both discs. Honestly, these were not hard at all, but like I said before, I sound like a broken record again. Um, you know, we're just getting help from the game itself. You know, kind of like a little tutorial in a sense. Uh, but uh, yeah, they basically work exactly like the uh, Nostradamus enigmas from the main story. Um, I'm debating whether or not to do the rest in this video or to just like have them in their own separate videos. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna do them. That's the last one should be in here. There we go. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, so this is where we're gonna be getting Sugar's, uh, I guess Eagle Sword. So that's pretty exciting. Perform the ritual prayer. Protege me in velamento alarum tuarum. Oh, that's pretty cool. Eagle of Sugar. Okay, yeah, this is going to be pretty dope. I'm actually going to equip it right now. I want to see how it looks. Alright, so it's right here. A short sword shaped by Sugar hit an enemy and light will appear to blind opponents. A light will appear to blind opponents. Damn, okay. So it's gonna be like a stagger effect in a sense. That's pretty freaking dope. Range of the light blinding effect. So if I upgrade it, yeah, I'm gonna upgrade this. Uh, I'm gonna equip this and upgrade it. It, it is a pretty small sword. It is a short sword. All right, I'm going to be using this for the meantime, and uh, yeah. All right, but that was Sugar's Legacy. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed 
this was honestly quite an adventure. I don't think I'm going to be adding all of the riddles in this uh, in this video because blankly it's way too long. And uh, there's times where I just got really frustrated trying to figure out the riddles themselves. But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll definitely see you guys next time. Peace.